I'm actually going to switch these names to so Raycat Thorn. Random. Did he really go? Was oh, that Mike D? Mike D is on the right. So it is Raycat going random. Raycat. Dude, no, matter of respect. himself tonight. Dude, matter of respect, man. It's always super I don't know hard. if that's respect or just disrespect from Raycat. I think Ooh. if he's that, confident that he can take out Mike D with a random character, he's definitely feeling himself tonight. I'm excited to see how this goes. Yeah, this is def Mike D is definitely a... I would call him a super frustrating character to play against, actually. Um, this is Winner's Round 2, actually. Winner's Round 2. So we are heading down to Smashville. Smashville, basically Good the as battlefield always. Yeah. of Smash gonna 4. Get Ike versus Yoshi. I don't believe I've ever seen this matchup before. Yeah, definitely. You know, Yoshi is definitely a character that's fallen off a little bit. It was definitely very dominant earlier in Smash 4's life. What? Yeah, dude, Ray Cat with a random. They got Ike. I can't go on. I can stand on there pretty well. Beautiful beat. You know what's the trainer earlier? The, the guy, Raycat, who's going, who went random, he's Ike. He has a sick Wii Fit trainer. It is terrifying. Yeah, no, he was playing Wii Fit trainer in front of Do you he think he's like, trying to hide the Wii Fit trainer for later? No, no, I don't think he is. Like, or is he, he just feeling himself? In I think he's just showing that he's going to take this tournament to the top. He is, because he is a scary person to play against. Like he Ben Dean hitting us with the truth. Truth bombs from Snow. I'm actually gonna switch over to this setup so it's higher quality. I don't know, this matchup's been back and forth, but all I've seen is just Raycat hitting these special shots. Definitely, yeah. And you'll definitely see in Mike D's playstyle that he really likes to go for forward airs and loves to space out with the eggs. He's, I've seen a lot of spacing out. I've also seen a lot of side throws into attempted uh, side airs. Yeah, definitely, definitely uh, the, forward, the forward air spike. Beautiful meteor. Ooh, the up air. Ooh, beautiful stock from Mike D. What do I have to play? I don't know how this, I don't, ran, is this random? Is this working out for Raycat, do you think? I don't know. Or do you think it was just, just the Yoshi? No, definitely Mike D's an extremely strong player, so it wouldn't surprise me if it's Mike D's play that's definitely beating out uh, Raycat. I'm just not sure how this random's going on. I mean, he's certainly feeling himself, but at this point, you know, 67% on his second stock. Mike D's making the lead. Yeah, definitely. If uh, things start to get hairy, Raycat might just bring out the Wii Fit Trainer, try to, you know, try to, you know, get down to business. Yeah, definitely. Goes for the counter. Almost punished for it. Beautiful death Oh, Ooh, the spike. Ooh, the spike. And uh, now, now Mike Beautiful. D is at a clean full stock over, over, over Raycat. Over Raycat, man. This... I know, I know. I always love to say, you know, one stock, it's not really that much of a leap, but in Smash 4 with the limited amount of stocks, it's definitely extremely important. It's to definitely have an issue for Raycat. Raycat yeah, is a bad spot. He's definitely going to have to. And have to look inside of himself and say, I can do He's going to have to awaken the cat. Yeah, he's definitely going to have to sell his soul a little bit to, to be the devil. Mike D trying to space. Mike D is definitely throwing out those eggs. Trying to space. There with the eggs again. Just keeping Great Cat occupied to make his next move. <laughs> what happened just there was basically a sum up of everything Mike D did. Mike D does. He just threw it up B. And then just tried to spike him with the forward air. Didn't quite work out, but that's all that Mike D does. And he wins. He's winning. He's got a full stock over Rick Raycat. Do you think it might just be um, not being able to counter it just yet? The Yoshi? Think, yeah, I think it's definitely, you know, at these smaller tournaments with a lot of people that, you know, aren't necessarily, like, top, top players. Definitely just the strategy of camping them out. It's Well, it's not even just camping, I believe. I mean, do you believe that Raycat knows his matchup well enough? Uh, it definitely Yoshi's I mean, because, a weird match. Like we said earlier, Yoshi used to be a very popular pick in Smash 4. Early in its career, it was a great pick. But definitely. now, I mean, it's it's fallen off, yes, but I mean, people still don't know how to counter it. That That's exactly what I'm saying. The fact, it's there almost it the goes. fact that he doesn't know the matchup. Like, the fact that he's fallen off makes it so that the, the matchup is harder. Maybe it's necessarily more of like a sleeper pick now, do you think? Yeah. Alrighty. Raycat. So Mike D is up 1 0 over Raycat. So you're going to stick with the randoms? Alright, shit, I got to 
Yeah. Ray Cat pulling out the Wii Fit Trainer. Ooh, we were right. I was, we were saying Ray Cat's gonna pull out the Wii Fit Trainer. Dude, look at this triple, triple. I'm gonna have to play my match after the next setup's open. So, uh, all right, you got this so, held down. Yeah. yeah. Okay, let's put the mic in between you two. Okay. So, Ready, so. so who's playing who right now? Uh, um, we this got is Ray Cat versus Mike D. Who's Mike D playing? Mike D is Yoshi. playing Yoshi. Yoshi. And then Raycat went, we, went random last match, Picked and now he's going with the trainer. Alright. We thought he was feeling himself. He just got punished for it. I don't know. Well, not the Wii Fit trainer. How is the Wii Fit trainer? <laughs> I mean, his Wii Fit trainer, all I've heard is that it's spectacular. Uh, not really super safe. Not just yet, no. Mike D's spacing really well. Yeah, he's really good at spacing pairs. I lied. I don't have to play a match for another two matches. So, uh, we're all good. We in there, boy? I don't know. He just seems lost this match. Up. I think since that, that first loss to this Yoshi, I don't know. Definitely shook him a little bit. Mike T is definitely using a lot more egg throw than he did last week. So. I mean, it was still almost crazy last week how much eggs he was throwing. It was really fun. Like, I had to play against him round one. It was see, I didn't, I didn't see that many egg throws last week. Nice I, I, I was always joking that there's those points where he tries to jump egg throw into forward air, and I always joke that that's the only two moves that he uses. He doesn't just like throw eggs forward air. But it, I mean, it's doing super well. He got second last week, you know. He's looking strong today, up 1 0 over Raycat. Mike, Mike D is certainly here to win today. Yeah, yeah. I just see nothing but great play. Good spacing. Raycat, I don't know what's happening. They just, I think it might just be this Yoshi fish. Did Raycat Mike D face last week? Uh, I don't think Raycat was here last week. No, he was not. Yeah, Mike D was here though. He got second place to draw second. It might just be Raycat just yeah. never having fought this matchup before. He doesn't know how to handle it. Yeah. yeah, Yoshi, he's a good character, but I don't see that many Yoshi players. That's the thing about it. Yeah, I don't either. At like, at this point, it's more of a sleeper pick. Yeah. Certainly I always thought Weepa Trainer was a good character, but like, I, I definitely understand her flaws, but like, she also has a ton of benefits to her. Well. I think it just takes a certain skill set to fire, and I do believe Raycat has that. Just Mike D is bringing it today. Nice. Yeah, dude. Spike Raycat on is about to lose his second stock, and Mike D hasn't even lost one yet. I always forget a lot that in uh, Smash 4, when you spike someone down, they can bounce off the stage, but in games like Melee, you just hit the stage. If you want to, if you want to get like a a dare, a dare to get them up. It has to be like with Ganon, they have to be on the stage. Yeah. yeah. With this game, no, you gotta like be sure to tech the stage even if you're above it. Now, we fit trainers upbeat is no damage, correct? I do not think it's so. just I recovery. It, yes, it's just recovery. I. She has like her salute. The sun is like really. Um, it's a really good projectile, I always thought. That's yeah, an amazing projectile. Yeah. And I love the fact that uh, that Raycat knew that Mikey was just going to keep throwing eggs, so he just stood there and just started yeah. charging. And Mikey just he was like, wait a minute. Oh, a nice back air to Ward Smash. Nice way to cover it. Going to for the platform. Ooh. Going for the egg. Mikey Spike feeling down. himself. Take it up that set 2-0. Take it up that set 2-0 over Raycat. Yeah, Raycat definitely had a really good... We've been trainer, but just Mike D's got an insane.